Welcome to Crash Racer. Today we're playing GTA 5 and we're going to do some online racing. We're going to have a couple of races. Starting off here at Sandy Shores. I think there's I think there's 10 of us in this race. Let's see how we get on. Let's uh, turn the radio off. Seven lap race. Always a good fun track to race on. A <laughs> really good start straight up into first place. Of course that doesn't really make uh, much difference at this stage. Seven lap race catch up and slipstream are on so as always just about trying to make as good progress as you can. Have as few fewer accidents, issues, spins, crashes as you can to hopefully be there or thereabouts come the end. Okay into this tight little section where we've got a left or right choice. Whoa. Thought I was going to get squeezed at one point there, but we're through. Still up near the front. Oh, don't spin me. Oh, just managed to uh, turn away from that and not get spun. Lost a bit of time. <coughs> oh, so I spun that one, didn't mean that. Back in the slipstream again, they're weaving about a bit, which makes it awkward. Oh, and I've been spun. I don't know if that was the. Uh, the same player that I accidentally spun or not but still quite early in the race though and we're not far behind so we should easily pick this uh, pick this back up again sneak up the inside here watch this one from the right see which way they're gonna go yeah they're taking it right oh bit of a hit there we'll give plenty of room for them to come through again no point as far as I'm concerned, fighting for places, battling, knocking people around, just trying to, uh, <laughs> just trying to stay in whatever place you're in, just for a bit longer. Like I say, overall, it's whoever finishes these seven laps in the fastest time is going to be the winner. So the least time I can spend backwards, sideways, off the track, the better. right up at the front is not always the best place to be because obviously you've got oh cars coming quickly and I've been hit from the side and I'm off can't save it tried to save it I'm gonna have to reset yeah try to save it because it normally is easier or it's not easy it's quicker to uh, get yourself back running again than it is to reset but no choice back in eighth place but we have got plenty of laps left still so I don't think it's a problem here yeah, we've got four laps left and the uh, the pack isn't that far ahead. We should be able to catch up as long as we don't get into uh, any more issues, of course. Oh, sorry, a little tap on the side there, didn't mean that. Let's pull away, make sure that's clear. Like I say, I don't want to be getting in a battle over 8th and ninth place. Take it on the outside here. You've sort of got the two choices of going around the corners. You either take it a bit wide and higher and use the boost pads, or you can run it on the inside up the curb and they both seem probably equally as quick I think that was unfortunate just got a bit of a slipstream as I was coming into that section so ran into the back of that car and lost my momentum this one's going a bit slow as well get away down the outside wall don't push me off a little bit of pushing going on there then let's not let's not uh, get into a battle in this little pack here we want to not work together necessarily but not get in each other's way so we can catch up with those that lead pack got a good slipstream here yeah just have to make sure they didn't try and tap my back end and spin that round <coughs> excuse me okay back in the slipstream again as we come over the finish oh a bit of a knock there but fine though two laps left so we're getting into the uh, business end of the race. Don't spin me. And we're where we want to be in that we're up near the front. There's a bit of a group of us though, five or six of us, which of course makes it dangerous. Into first again. Again, not that that's going to last long, but uh, they've dropped back a little bit actually. I, I guess they were starting to battle a bit more and they've knocked each other. Yeah, they have dropped 
back but there's no way we're going to hold this lead with catch up in fact there's someone right behind us now hit the back of us okay here we go start of the last lap all to play for and as i say we're up where we want to be oh big hit there as always i'm guessing it's going to get a little bit more frantic a little bit more dirty so we've got to try and stay out of trouble i'm going to hold my line here in the center hopefully people will come around and not try and hit me need to be in a good position a few of the others have dropped back it looks like it might be just the three of us obviously again with catch up i think that one spin round there looking at the map second place is just outside us pulled in front that's actually quite good if we can get in the slipstream here and pick the opposite way to them which way are they going they're going left let's take it right we should have the run on on them there it's quite close but we're through through for a win Oh, that was a really enjoyable race. I enjoyed that. It was a good close battle, not too dirty, and uh, a right battle right to the end. Okay, for the second race today, we are going to be at the City Slick. This is quite a pack field. I think there's 24 of us, and this track is always, because of the how tight it is it's always ends up being a dirtier race a lot more collisions again it's seven laps let's see how we get an all bit of a knock from the side when's the chaos going to start here we go spinners tumblers we've managed to pick a way through that first little group <laughs> we've managed to pick somehow a way right through the middle and we were in fit well temporarily we were in first place there right from the middle of the pack managed to get through i don't think with even touching anyone that was a, that was probably the best start i've ever had on this uh, track with so many cars oh just got sideswiped there i'm in the barrier oh that was lucky that was lucky got sideswiped and got turned into the barrier it was going to take me quite a while to get out i'd have had to reverse back out of that but fortunately there was a pink car came up on its slide, up on its uh, side around the barriers, and knocked my front end forward again. So I haven't actually lost too much time. Still in fourth place. Can we get a run on this car up round uh, this bank corner? Okay, up into third. Then we'll try and do a little bit of. Uh, running off these banks that does uh, increase your speed a little bit so we'll do some of that always check on the map when I'm doing that check there's no one coming up behind me last thing I want to do is knock someone up the someone behind me now so I'm going to hold position now I can even perhaps get in the slipstream of this car anyway don't want to knock them if possible they're still inside so I'm going to wait and pull up inside them going the long way round again not really in any rush to try and take the lead and uh, get past just want to make good fast progress around these laps have as few incidents as possible and with any luck be there or thereabouts at the end oh that's just what we need uncle in traffic okay that can be the problem in such a packed field with like 24 vehicles as soon as uh, one or two have some bad crashes and think they're out of the race they can then start driving around the opposite way around the uh, track to try and ruin the race for others as well so that's a an extra little thing we've now got to watch out for right in the slipstream of the leader still trying to watch out on the map now for uh, any possible back markers coming the opposite way looks like we're clear at the moment again don't really want to fight these uh, of the two cars up at the front and if we can even work together a little bit slipstream with each other if possible so that our lap times are faster and the uh, any chasing cars don't catch up quite as quickly oh second and third have dropped back a bit again way too way too early for me for me to be able to uh, think about staying in first and carrying this all the way to the finish unless uh, unless they really tangle with each other they're going to be back behind me within any within no time at all so a couple of back markers ahead going the right way fortunately wondering if I can even get in their slipstream that might help because yeah look at this my speed <laughs> being at the front and with catch up in full effect I'm going at snail's pace yeah 
yeah, you can't you can't stay out uh, out in front on your own for long. Walt, those two are having a bit of a ding dong again. Walt, yeah, watch where you're driving. Not a lot I could do about that. That car just swerved, I'm trying to use the the ramp to get speed up, but just swerved straight in front of me. They uh, they really needed to at least have a glance and realise that someone was around. Fortunately for us, it was them that paid the price. Okay, couple chasing us. Quick look at the map. Looks like we're cleared. I don't think there's anyone hiding around here waiting for us. Okay, don't want to speak too soon, but so far the race has gone fairly well. We've been up and around the front for the whole race at least. And certainly with the leaders so far, I wouldn't say they've been overly dirty. Oh, can I get around the outside? Oh, I just saw that one had got spun and wondered if I could get around the outside or if I was going to get caught up in that accident. Again, it's the other two, and I've managed to avoid getting involved. So again, that's going to give me a bit of a, a bit of a lead. Again, way too early though for that to uh, be decisive. I think. Obviously, my speed again has really, really dropped with me being out in the lead all on my own. Could really do with catching that back marker just ahead try and get some slipstream but of course they're going to be driving much faster than I am so unless they make a mistake it's unlikely or they have made a mistake as well if that was the same one but that's not really helped me get any slipstream okay getting towards the uh, towards the oh no <coughs> didn't see that back marker coming the opposite way head on that has uh, really ruined things and I've really got very little speed now trying to get up this ramp this can be tricky you can slide back down and not get the checkpoint whoa just about managed to get it still in second place I think that's third place right behind us as well okay two laps to go that was going to happen that was probably the best time for it to happen we've got time to catch up I don't think that's an issue obviously the issue is <laughs> that uh, it could happen again oh and I've been spun been spun by that one coming past okay down to fourth place now it's a bat market gone past as well fourth place I think fourth must be that's probably the lowest in fact I'm wondering that that's poss possibly the lowest place I've been since I don't know since the very start of the race it might be into third ones had a crop up already okay well we're not out of it that's the main thing and as I say unless you're well in the lead whoa another one blocking the path oh managed to avoid the head on this time still in third place two leaders avoided it as well yeah, we're we're not in a bad position if we can avoid all these cars driving the not driving the wrong way. Because uh, unless you've got a big lead coming up to the end, you don't really want to be in first because you're a bit of a sitting duck with the catch up. Okay, back market in there. Just got to watch this car's tangled there. Which one was that? That was third place. So that puts us up into well, it was second place. Sorry that's put us up into second and the back marker and the leader have crashed as well that's put us up into first they've got going quite quickly so again I'm wondering if that's going to be enough two of them might be behind me I don't know if one's a back marker got to watch if they sling it up the inside or oh, they've just dropped back on the map they've obviously had a coming together they were both uh, approaching really fast and I was just waiting then for as I was taking that corner a little easy and on the outside I was waiting for them to fling it up the inside and spin me round but fortunately that's not happened and I have got quite a lead now I'm not sure I'm not sure they're going to be able to catch me up now I think we've got a big enough lead 
Yep, through we come for a win. Well, fantastic race that one, really enjoyed that. A really good battle, managed to keep it up at the front all the way. And uh, as I say, that by far is the best start I've ever had in, uh, in that race, or probably any race actually. Well, I hope you've enjoyed watching the video, and see you soon.